Hey, this is Jim coming at you live with another segment with the real estate expert dot online. Thanks for joining me folks. Today we're going to talk about real estate investing. I don't know if you've been watching the news lately, but it's kind of scary out there. Do you realize the stock market has dropped the lowest since 2008? If any of you have been around during that era, well, it was mortgage fraud and over 600 million people have lost their properties to foreclosure. Now, I don't think that will ever happen again, fingers crossed, but there's a new thing going on, you know, with the market. And we always have to be aware of what is going on and what can we do about it? What does it mean when the stock market plummets? Well, first of all, you have to realize that the stock market is built around the business industry. So businesses have stock in their business. And when the businesses go below, then the markets fall. So what is the cause of this and what can we do about it? Well, those are great questions and I have some great answers for you. So stick around. But before I get started, please chime in below, subscribe to my channel. I have some awesome information to share with you as well as please message and do some comments to me. And I'd love to hear from you and answer some questions that you may be struggling with. So a little background on me. I'm a real estate investor. I've been investing in real estate since 1993. I service all 50 states and we have a pretty large company that uh, works with obtaining properties so we can help people become homeowners. So let's get back to the stock market and another recession that very well is going to happen at some point. We just don't know exactly when because we just don't have that crystal ball. But some of what has stemmed from this is the interest rates have doubled twice as much in one year. That's the most in history, folks. That is crazy. So, you know, the government's trying to avoid a recession. Well, as you know, we're also fighting through the COVID and there's a war in U Ukraine right now with Russia. So those are things that play factors as well. So what can we do about it? Well, also, people are struggling financially because of the gas prices and increase in food. So it's hard to keep food on the table and keep the bills paid. Well, also, we've had an overinflation of property values have gone up, skyrocketed. Well, that's all going to come tumbling down. But before it does, people are going to be challenged with trying to keep their mortgage paid due to the fact that Taxes are going to increase because they're reassessing property values. And when they reassess property values and increase, taxes increase as well. So therefore, if you have an escrow payment, obviously the taxes are included in that payment and your payment's going to go up. Could be anywhere from $100 to $250. We don't know for sure, but that's a significant amount of money when you as a family are trying to budget and try to keep you know, keep uh, your, your, your expenses down. So the one way, and, and I'm so excited about this because I've been practicing real estate for a long time and we always pride ourselves to help people create win-win situations and we do it through real estate investing. So if you're a wannabe real estate investor and you don't know really know where to go or how to get started, we can be a great resource for you. You can start as little as five to ten thousand dollars and get rates of returns of anywhere from twenty to forty five percent. That's amazing. You're not going to get that in the stock market. So my general rule of thumb has always been if you can't see it, you can't touch it, you can't control it, don't invest in it. So I got out of the stock market investing a long time ago when I lost everything. There's millions of people who have lost money in the stock market because you just can't control the outcome. It's kind of a figment of your imagination, if you will, because again, you can't see it, you can't touch it, and you can't control it. You're investing in businesses to, to succeed. And as long as they do, then your money has increased in value as well. So I won't go into all the stock market and uh, buying and selling at the right time. I just, it, it's a crazy business. The key thing is to focus on something that's real, tangible, 
and something that you can control. As you know, everybody needs a house to live in. You have to have a roof over your head. So that's, that's a, a bare necessity. So that's why I invest in real estate. So if you want to learn more about how to get started, I'd love to hear from you. You can chime in. Uh, my number is down below. But I want to go over some numbers with you. So again, you could initially invest with as little as you know, five to ten thousand dollars. And what we do as an investment company, we'll bring you in on a property that we have, that we own, and we'll run the numbers for you. So we'll we'll show you exactly how much that you're going to generate from this property as well as the length of time where you could get your money back. So typically um, on an average, just giving you an example, you could do five, ten grand or, or more down. Obviously the more the better. And what we do is we'll place a tenant buyer in the property. So they'll put up a, a certain amount of money towards the purchase. We help them facilitate getting their credit in order so they can buy the property from us at a future date while you're getting a portion of that monthly payment to you every every month that they're in there. At some point, we'll cash you out your money. You can continue investing in us and then you get 50% of the profits as well. So this is a great opportunity. This is something to get excited about. This is recession proof, so you don't have to worry about uh, losing all your money in the stock market. So, again, thanks for joining me. Love to hear from you. And until then, make it a great day, folks. Bye for now.